Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to explore an exciting web-based tool called Teachable Machine from Google. Machine learning is often perceived as a complex process, but what if it could be simplified with a no-code, drag-and-drop tool? That's the idea behind Teachable Machine. While it's not an official Google product, it's an AI experiment developed by an internal team at Google. The training pipeline here leverages JavaScript libraries like TensorFlow.js, ML5.js, and P5.js. Under the hood, it uses predefined models for each category. For example, in image classification, it employs a MobileNet V2-based CNN model for accurate classification. Teachable Machine allows you to train machine learning models directly in your browser using JavaScript. The tool makes use of the browser's capabilities to run machine learning models efficiently. Once you've selected the type of model you want to create, be it image, sound, or pose detection, Teachable Machine uses these predefined models to streamline the training process. Everything happens within the browser, ensuring that your data doesn't leave your local environment, adding an extra layer of privacy and convenience. Now let's dive into a quick demo to see how it works in practice. We'll start by navigating to the Teachable Machine platform. Once you're on the site, you'll see three options for model types, image, sound, and pose. For this demo, let's go with image classification. Now let's set up our model by creating two classes. We'll begin with the first class named toy. Using the webcam, we'll capture real-time images of a toy. You can hold the toy in front of the camera and move it around slightly to capture different angles and perspectives. This helps the model learn to recognize the toy in various scenarios. Once we've captured enough images of the toy, we're ready to move on to the second class. Let's call this one book. With both classes, toy and book, fully set up and images captured, it's time to train the model. Click the Train Model button and Teachable Machine will process the images to create a model that can differentiate between the two classes. The training will take a few moments depending on the number of images. Once the training is complete, we can test our model using the preview feature. Let's hold up the toy or book in front of the webcam and see if the model correctly classifies them. This real-time feedback lets us quickly evaluate the performance of our trained model. Finally, we can see that the model performs well. Now let's download it in the preferred format. Teachable Machine offers various export options, including TensorFlow.js for web applications, TensorFlow Lite for mobile apps, or formats compatible with hardware like Arduino. This flexibility allows you to easily integrate the model into your projects. That's it for this video. In the next one, we'll be using the model we just trained in some real-time projects, so stay tuned for that. If you've used any similar tools like Teachable Machine, feel free to share your experience in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.